it was amazing. You guys are very animated. I think the message is clear. You know, let's take care of the victim, let's take care of the, the bully, and let's take care of the bystander. And I think the bystander is the key, if you ask me, mm -hmm. because that's the person who can actually help everybody else by speaking up. <laughs> so I don't know, so I was saying that the, the conversation you have with students about bullying and peer pressure is the same kind of talk that adults try to have with young people. But they don't buy it from us. Our experiences are too far removed from their, from their everyday life. And when they see the high top fade, and when they see Joey in the blue hair, because we actually have students who come to school with blue hair, and they're like, they're the outcast. Or if you don't speak the same language, or you guys identified, you know, didn't wear the same clothes, your pants weren't sagging. So for, for one of our babies here, he was like, wow, for real? You know, these things are happening to you, instilled in them this sense of confidence. This sense of there are people in the building I can trust, and there are people like me in the world every day. So I did an awesome job and keep that message going. And all the adults that I know and educators will rally behind you. Go get them, because they need it. They need them. They need them. And we just did our Take a Stand to Stop Bullying campaign. Crazy response, as always. The students, I feel, really got the message. We even visited a few classrooms afterwards and took some questions. They were very, very how do you feel? I feel good. Like they actually had just asked us if we could come back and do one of our other presentations. Ready? Go. Hello, everybody. My name is Joey. We are here at Camilla Gibran. We just got finished performing for the kids. Our standing tall to stop bullying seminar. Um, it was really great. The kids were amazing. They were a great crowd. Um, they really got the message. We went back to the classrooms to talk to them. And they were repeating everything word for word and also giving a lot of good statements and commentary on how bullying affects them. So this is really, I'm really happy and very inspired.